Hello, I'm Allison here for Gene Codes Corporation to show you how to install the next generation sequencing tools for Sequencer 5.1. The first thing you will need to do is go to the GeneCodes.com website and under the support column, choose the next generation sequencing installer. This will bring you to a landing page with everything you will need for this installation. The instructions are split up between Windows and Mac users. We will start with a Windows installation and finish this demonstration with a Mac installation. For Windows users, we will begin by downloading the external tools installer zip file. We will unzip this file and double click on the external tools installer.exe. We will extract all and accept all the default settings. This will install Sequencer's plugins to GSNAP, MAQ, MacView, Muscle, and Velvet. Now that this is complete, we will install the tablet viewer. To do this, we will open the tablet folder. And here we will find two separate installers. The tablet Windows X64 installer is for Windows 64-bit systems. And the Windows X86 installer is for Windows 32-bit systems. It is important that you know which system you have when installing Tablet. I will go ahead and choose the 64-bit installer. If you do not have admin privileges, right-click on the Tablet installer and select Run as Administrator. And when you're presented with a dialog box, select Run to continue. We will again select all the defaults. When asked for the destination location, the default location is already set. It is important that you do not change this location. Now we will finish the Windows External Tools installation with Clustal. We will open the Clustal W2 folder and once again you will need administrator privileges. Or you can right click on the Clustal installer and select Run as Administrator. We will again select all the default settings and when prompted for the destination location it is important that you do not change the already set location. After completion of the Clustal installation, the Windows Next Generation tools are all ready to be used in Sequencer. If you feel like you've missed a step or if you would like to go back and look over the written instructions, they are all laid out here on the website. Now we will switch over to the Mac Next Generation Sequencing Tools installation. You must be an administrator in order to download these next-gen tools for Sequencer. We will begin by downloading the external tools installer.dmg file. When we double-click on the downloaded file, the external tools installer window will open automatically. You will need to know if your machine is a 64 or a 32-bit system to pick the correct installer. My machine is a 64-bit, so I will use the 64-bit installer. A welcome window will pop up and we will click continue and the next window agree to keep the installation going. Now we will begin the installation. The installer will give you some status messages until the installation complete window. The installer just installed Sequencer plugins to GSNAP, Velvet, 
MAQ, MacView, and Muscle. To install Tablet, we are going to double click on the Other Installers folder. And you can open the Tablet folder. You must go into your system preferences and make sure that your security and privacy settings allow downloads from anywhere. And now we can open the tablet installer. We will accept all default settings, including the default location. Tablet will then be placed into the applications folder automatically. To install Clustal, double click on the Clustal W2.gmg file. Open the folder, and we will need to drag the Clustal W2 application into the Applications folder. You may need to run Clustal one time if you are using Mountain Lion by double-clicking the Clustal W2 application. With Clustal and Tablet in the Applications folder and the external tools installer completed, Sequencer is now ready to handle any NGS dataset.